What's going on, YouTube, man? I'm here with a, another video. I know I'm supposed to, I'm in the middle of this 30-day Popeye's challenge. Right now, I'm at, uh, what's today's date? I kind of lost count. What's today's date? I'm asking my, my friend here, what's, the, what's today's date? The 24th. 24th. Okay, today's the 24th, so that means I've been into this challenge for 20, well, no, not 20 days, 18 days so far, but I'm still on it. Like, you know, let's go. I started on the 6th, all the way up from here. I've been eating Popeyes, Popeyes every day, at least twice a day. Like, I'm trying to eat it three times a day if I can squeeze it in, but at least twice a day when I wake up and when I go to sleep, I'm eating Popeyes. So what, just because you don't think I'm lying. I got my Popeyes right here, just in case this little side thing that I want to try. Cause like, man, I'm just like, can you eat Popeyes for 30 days and try to eat something else? Let's find out. This is something like I was trying to get a gyro. I don't know. I've been going past this place for almost 20 days, getting Popeyes. It's called Ant 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 Auntie. What what is called? Anta, Anta, Annette. Oh, I call it. You know, I'm a nigga, so excuse me. I'm gonna bleep that out. But yeah. Annette, Annette, whatever. I almost call it Ant. You know what I'm saying? But Annette, 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 Annette. That's what I'm gonna call Ant at. I'm gonna Ant at at this. Like you know what I'm saying. This shit already sloppy. I ain't gonna lie. So I'm gonna put it here. I guess you gotta rip the bag open because it's kind of everywhere. This don't look like no guy row I ever seen. I'm gonna tell you that here first. No guy row that I ever seen. It's kind of that's the deep the sauce. You know that sauce that we we use to get in there. You know what I'm saying? Let me show my friend. You see that? That I guess that's gyro meat. That's gyro meat. Oh, I had to show my friend that that that's gyro. There ain't no gyro meat we ever seen here in the states. Like you know, I don't know. Maybe this is fresh. People always told me it was lamb. So I went in there and said, "Give me the lamb gyro. Oh, the trauma. Some I don't know." It sense like the gyro bread that they sell at the Walmart, so. Hey, buddy, ain't cucumbers on there, right? The tzatziki sauce? Yeah, the tzatziki. Hold on. I'm gonna go in for another bite, because that first one I couldn't tell. I don't want to eat no lion. I ain't gonna lie. It tastes kind of, I don't know, like nothingness. Like it ain't got no beefy, like irony taste or nothing like Maybe it's because it's all the sauce. You got to taste the meat of the season. Ooh. You taste anything close to a girl? No, not yet. I wouldn't call this a gyro. At all. No mean. This is lamb meat. Is good? And some bread. I ain't going to call it good either. But it ain't nasty. <laughs> It's like Roman noodles. You be like, uh, some uh, kind that you ain't never had before. And you be like, it ain't bad, but I don't like it. It ain't bad, but it ain't good. Yeah. So. I tried. Maybe I need to get some more bread.
I'm glad I didn't go with a full one. Because. Yeah, this was a half one. So, like, hopefully. Yeah. Yeah. Don't go for food when you're just testing. Go for the snack size. Now, I'm going to try one more other thing here. It's this place called Stillers. They think it's like similar to like a, I guess a Burger King and a McDonald's like all together. It's like biggest McDonald's, but they flame bro stuff like Burger King. <laughs> so on my next video, y'all. Peace.